Hey guys, AJRM6200 here, and welcome back to my playthrough of Sonic Mania. Last time we were, we finished off Green Hill Zone, and here we are with Chemical Plant. And, right off the bat, I just want to say this is my second time recording this, because last time I recorded, I was playing so much, I was playing like crap, so much. Like, you wouldn't even believe it. And I think there was this glitch. Where, like, in the boss for Act 2. Like, I would beat Eggman. I'd beat Robotnik. But, like, I would still die. And that costed me, like, let's say I had, like, five lives. So I died, like, three times. And it, it was just insanity. I had to redo the recording, but anyway. Welcome back, everyone. Again, this is Chemical Plant Zone. This is, like, my favorite zone. And, uh... Sonic the Hedgehog 2, and I think that's the case for everyone else that played Sonic the Hedgehog 2, because you, this, like, Sonic has always been about speed, but I think this zone was really where it shined, where the speed really shined, because in Sonic 2, there were times where you'd see, um, Sonic, like, go off camera, and that was, like, mind-blowing to everyone. Gotta love that Sega... Black blast process blast processing technology. Anyway, this purple water section, I'm pretty sure this gave a lot of players nightmares. I know it gave me nightmares. Because oh, I almost fell fell off that. I know it gave me nightmares because I remember when I first got into that section, when I first played uh, Sonic 2 on I think it was Sonic's Ultimate Genesis collection on the Xbox 360. I remember when I first played that section, and I could not for the life of me get past that section. Like, I would, like, the first try, but then when it's, like, the second try or third try, I, I just can't because I have to start all, like, all over again from the bottom because I'll either, like, fall off the platform, the moving platforms. And when I try to redo it, I'll drown. Anyway, we're gonna do another one of these. Remember when I said in the last episode, mark my words, I will beat one of these stages? Well, you probably won't be seeing that. <laughs> oh, jeez. That sucks. That was such a huge screw-up right there. That was probably my fault, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, now this boss fight is... All about waiting and attacking. What he does is that he'll dive into the chemical. Screw you. He'll dive into the chemicals, and I'm just gonna abuse my, my, uh, my invincibility frames. He'll dive into the chemicals and will form a little chemical shield where he can protect himself with. He'll bounce like three times, and if you have to dodge him, and dang it, I wanted to spin dash. Once again, I'm playing like crap, but. If Hey, if I can at least get past the, uh, the second boss fight, I'll be cool with it. Because I just want to get this part uploaded. Whether I play like crap or not, I just want to get it uploaded. But yeah, he'll bounce around a few times and once his shield is gone, go for the hit. Abuse your in invincibility frames if you'd like. Anyway, here's Chemical Plant Act 2 Zone. I'm gonna mute my mic so you can just listen to this awesome remix. I love it. Here comes the best part, you ready? Isn't that just amazing? The soundtrack in Sonic Mania, I absolutely love it. Like, this is like one of my favorite remixes in this game. So not only... This is one. This is also one of my favorite acts for both the music and the uh, the new gimmicks. Which reminds me, like I said in part one, 
Act 1 is going to be mostly similar to the original level design for the remade stages. But once you get to Act 2, level design is going to be almost completely different. Like, you don't remember those uh, stick purple sticky platforms uh, being in the original game of Sonic 2. So, yeah, those things, you can just stick onto those and they'll, like, move you up a bit. Same thing for the purple bubble you saw earlier. That'll raise you up to get to where you need to be. And, I don't know, I like the gimmicks. I think the purple platforms are interesting. Like that purple bubble right there. Anyway, I'm gonna go into this bonus stage. Hope to God that I can get this one right. Alright, I gotta concentrate. So if I'm quiet, that's why. No! Are you kidding me? I... I did not mean to jump over that. Oh my god. This is gonna be fun. These bonus stages are gonna be fun. Again, I don't have to do these. They're optional. They're pointless. They're only for medallions, for like extras and stuff, so... They're not for like a Chaos Emerald or anything. But I just want to at least complete one of them. At least one of them. For this playthrough. Then my life will be complete. And is this the, uh, the boss battle? No, it's not. We have to go over here. Playing up there. Also, um, did anyone- this is, uh, did anyone see on, uh, the Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, official Twitter, on um, that video that they released of, uh, Sonic Mania, where they're in Chemical Plant Zone Act 2, Sonic bounces onto the, uh, the, uh, the gel, and, uh, what was it? Oh yeah, he'll bounce on the gel, and then it'll cut to, like, reality, where they just throw, like, a Sonic the Hedgehog action figure or whatever into an actual actual container of gelatin. <laughs> and he doesn't even, like, bounce. It's hilarious. You should check it out. I'll probably put a link to the video if I can find it. I'm pr I think it's on, uh, on their YouTube channel, so... If I can find it on YouTube, I'll put the... Dis I'll put the link in the description because I don't know. I love the video. I love it. Oh my god. Could we actually get this one right? Could we actually get this one right? I probably I probably jinxed myself. Yup, I jinxed myself. Did you see that? 12 blue spheres. I almost had it. Oh my god. I swear to god. I'm, not gonna, I'm never going to be able to complete one of these for the playthrough. But you saw that, I had like 12 blue spheres left, I almost had it. Anyway, when I first played this boss battle, this took me by surprise. This boss battle is actually supposed to be uh, two references. It's supposed to be a reference to Poyo Poyo and Dr. Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine. Now, I haven't really played any of uh, Poyo Poyo, however, I have played my fair share of Dr. Robotnik's Mean, mean Bean Machine. Is. It's pretty fun. It's a pretty fun puzzle game. That game I also played on, uh... On the, uh... Sonic's Ultimate Genesis Collection. But yeah, it's a fun little puzzle game. And Dr. Robotic. He just screwed me over big time. Alright. Now I'm really gonna have to focus. So if I'm quiet... I'm sorry, but I need to concentrate. I'm kind of surprised I'm even doing this bad. At least on this boss fight, because I used to get through this boss fight with no sweat. So to know that I'm actually kind of doing playing like crap here. And it's probably that Let's Play curse. But yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna be quiet, just so I can try and... 
try and beat this boss without failing. Alright, let's do this. Alright, there we go. Alright, yeah, we're back in the game now. There we go, we're making a comeback. We got rid of all those. We're we're good to go now. Alright, uh place a blue one there. Why not? So we can place another blue one here with a purple. And match these up. And we win! There we go. Can we actually reach the, uh... Oh, we almost had it. I tried to bounce up on the spring so I could see if I could land on the, uh... On the, uh... The animal canister. Well, I barely had it. Lights, camera, action. I love this zone. Sadly, I can't I can't play it for this part, so we're gonna have to come we're gonna have to play this in part three. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to leave a like and a comment. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more content, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao.